So I'm really surprised that ACDC keep releasing albums after all these years. It's just a, it's a, it's a great surprise for all of us. I mean, I was a huge ACDC fan and I'm still in a way, but I don't really listen to them as much because uh, I kind of moved away from that type of music a bit, but I still enjoy it a lot every time I, I listen to it. And obviously listening to those classic albums bring me a lot of good memories. So when they announced that the the lineup, the classic lineup was reuniting minus uh, Malcolm Young, obviously, I was really surprised and shocked in a good way. And not only that, they're releasing a full album <clears throat> and they released the first uh, single of that album called Shot in the Dark. Now the album is called Powered Up and that'll be released uh, soon this year. And uh, yeah, I mean, this is just like ACDC by the numbers, nothing new here. Um, this is not going to gain any new fans. Um, but, uh, you know, it just does what it says. You know, it's, it's a great track to listen to. It reminds me of uh, some of the early material uh, uh, from A Flick of the Switch and Fly on the Wall, to be honest. I don't know why, maybe that's, it's just that bluesy feel at the beginning and throughout the the song but anyway yeah i'm really glad that they are re reuniting and there's new music the only shame is that there there will not be any world tours anytime soon because of the the world situation unless they find a way to to make a reduced size like crowd venues like with uh with social distancing and all that uh, we still don't know what's going to happen in terms of of um, live music in the next few years. But, uh, I mean, if they announce a show, I'll be willing to go, of course. Even if it means that I'll have to, you know, uh, maybe pay more for the ticket. Maybe that's what they're going to do in regards to gigs. There'll be less people, but they'll charge more. For people to be there and maybe they can stream it and people can pay uh, a lower fee if they want to watch it online i don't know um, but anyway i'm really excited about these new records uh power up by acdc again this came as a surprise not only to me but to uh the whole of the rock community i guess because nobody was expecting acdc to release new music and also to bring the the classic lineup back with Phil Rudd, Cliff Williams, and Brian Johnson, who had their own problems, and they they kind of quit the band, but now they seem to have reunited and they're bringing a new record. So this is just like absolutely amazing, the best news uh, for ACDC fans around the world. And yeah, I can't wait to hear it in full and talk about it.